Hey everybody and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth and when we last left off I said that twice and I shall not do so again. We also lost playing as Lilith against uh, Mum's heart was it? We got pretty far but eventually lost because I'm poop. Anyway, I've looked through the comments and we've had a fair few replies regarding different people. The Keeper almost won again, which I know I'm happy to do, uh, but sadly the other difficult character, the Lost, <laughs> won in this. So we'll play hard mode. We're going for Mega Satan or Hush. Probably we're going to focus on Hush and try to speed run through. I think it's going to be the best thing. Am I salty playing as the Lost? No, we have Holy Mantle now. Uh, I like the Holy Mantle, it should keep me safe, I should be fine, if I die it is more than likely going to be my own fault. The the bad thing is we can't use the D4, well we could, but if we use the D4 then we lose Holy Mantle. Nine inch nail, 8 inch nail sorry, is a great item to get, oh that looks brutal. Uh, no time to hang around, we are rushing through because we want to get to Hush. I guess we're not in as big of a rush to get to Hush as we are to get to Boss Rush. Boss Rush is 20 minutes, whereas Hush is only 30. So you have 10 extra minutes to do two floors, which is... I don't even know what that would do for us. The Faded Polaroid lets you come back from death as a Lost. Since we are the Lost, I don't think it would allow that to happen. Anyway, Dangle, our first boss. We don't fight this guy that often. I think he charges four times, right? Two. Oh, just twice. Okay. Shouldn't be too difficult here. Wow, that was scary. He came out of that poop super fast. Oh no! Oh yeah, we can do this. Might do a little bit of dodging here, because... I'm not... Oh no, I'm not entirely convinced that those corns are getting stopped by the... Oh no, that was silly. That was entirely my own fault. I wasn't entirely sure if those corns were going over the rocks and they were just missing me. Or whether or not they were actually uh, colliding with the rocks and I was safe. Leech! Decent. Doesn't really provide any major benefit to us uh, because we can't regen health. Ooh. But, you know, it's it's handy. These chests I appreciate. I would really love if uh, it gave me something I could use, though. Oh, we could go all D4 with the batteries here, but we're not going to. We'll take a pill. Pill is T is down. Super bad pill. Super bad pill. Got a key in there. We'll go back for that. See, Leech isn't bad. He will attack enemies. And I we could literally guarantee a hush win. With leech, all we would need is uh, what's it called? The nod leaf, which in general is a really good item to have for uh, the lost. I picked up the super magnet. I've never really taken this before. I'm assuming it pulls in items rather than coins, but it does seem to be pulling in enemies. Maybe that's just maybe that's just me. Seeing what I want to see. This is super annoying. Leech there, restoring our health, which we don't have. Leech is, Leech is really good. I enjoy Leech. Against bosses, he's not going to be tremendous, but... Against annoying... Oh, it does seem to pull items in. It does seem to pull items in. There's our shop. Is it pulling the enemy? Am I just seeing things? I think I am. I've lost Holy Mantle there like an idiot. Okay, that was that was genuinely bad from me. Okay, focus. Get your head in the game. We're going to play. We're going to win. We're going to go in here because we can. I'm going to risk this. That was terrifying. We'll leave. <laughs> I can't believe I actually managed to pull that off as well. All right, fine. Can we come down here? There we go. I was hoping the explosions would also kill... <gasps> These guys, sadly not. Take the key. We'll get uh, Capric uh, Sagittarius, sorry for piercing shots. 
and it's I think it's a speed up too. Uh, so this I'm very happy with this run once again. Piercing and spectral tears are a fantastic combination. Now we just want to get some like damage up. I don't like spiders because they're erratic. And you should be dead, and then this one's gonna be super easy. I'm not gonna die to that. Key is lovely. Okay, moving on through. I don't like this. Uh, I less so like that invisible guy. Whoa, I lost my holy mantle there. So you see how easy it is to get hit? Uh, and without the holy mantle, we would have been dead there. We would have sadly passed on to the next life. Which could be worse. Could be better. There's... Oh no, I've been hit. I hate rooms full of spiders. Oh. I hate rooms full of spiders because they're so erratic in their movements. Again, I'm not blaming... Oh, Kess of the Unknown. We get the ba uh, Book of Revelations. It's interesting. Uh, kill me. <laughs> it was interesting in that uh, it did very little for us. Uh, it would have given us soul hearts to use. However, those soul hearts would have done nothing for us. It would have also guaranteed a horseman fight. Which would have guaranteed us a cube of meat or a ball of bandages. While that is pretty nice to have. Uh, I'd probably not encourage that to happen. Because, very simply, the item we could have gotten from a non-horseman fight could have been far, far better. Rubber tier cement. Yep, yeah, I'll take it. Bombs. Excellent. We will bomb uh, this guy. Okay, I'm liking it, I'm liking it. Because now we can bomb this guy. Okay. I don't know what I was expecting. Well, small rock, to be honest, but... I'm okay, rubber cement is pretty decent. I'm not entirely sure how well it works with spectral tears. Full health uh, does nothing, but it's good to know. Okay, so spectral tears, um, it seems to break spectral tears. That's not good. Yeah, rubber cement... Uh, has pretty much ruined this run. So I think we're just going to just end it now. Our, our big... Kill me. <laughs> our big thing as the Lost is being able to hide and shoot. Uh, it basically removed our one advantage as the Lost. That's nice. So the rest of it would be good for bouncing tears around, but... I mean, come on. Come on. I was really hoping for a bomb. Again, bombs. Oh, yeah. Blow up the secret room, please. There's my secret room. wasn't there. Uh, there's a skinny room next to it, so of course it wasn't going to be there. I should analyse the map slightly better. I hate this for everything it's worth. These leaping enemies and fires that shoot me. We've already lost our... Holy mantle. Get away. Oh! It's okay, it's okay. I mean, we've only died, what, seven times in the last nine minutes? That's not the worst thing to have had happen. Look, this is our advantage. We can hide and shoot. There's the boss. Uh, is that the first time we've seen the boss? I think it is. Uh, we've been hit. I'm going to call it when it happens because uh, it shouldn't happen that much. If it happens, it's usually me being poop. Oh, that was a nice chest. I walked into a flame. I actually walked into a flame. Oh, this is... Okay, I'm liking this. There's plenty of stuff to collect. Looks like we're on form for getting an arcade. Does an arcade do much for us? Uh, not at all, in fact. We can't use... We cannot use... For goodness sake. We cannot use the blood bank machine because it will kill us. I think even with the holy mantle, it would kill us. And playing the other games... Doesn't really do that much. This might be worth going to the shop. We have 14 coins. Get away. Also, one of the things I really like about the Lost is just flight. Flight is such a good thing. I, I think I've said this before, but I would love it if they added a character. Just basic stats, nothing too special. But give them the, the ability to fly. I think that would be top. I would love just starting out as an, 
a flying character. Unfortunately, at the moment, the only character that does that is Zazel and the Lost. And Azazel is not a character that I want to play with that often because it's too easy. I don't like the laser beam. Well, I like it. It's just, it just makes it too easy. I just want a character that can fly from the beginning and has some average stats. Sure, I'll take this. Friendly ball. You can catch an enemy and then have it on your team. It will eventually die. Oh, this could be, this could be good. This could be very good. Throw some bombs over here, please. Hey. Can I catch you? I have no idea. I'm going to try and catch this guy. Come on, throw some bombs. Excellent. Throw some more bombs. Excellent. Right, try and bomb this, please. Hello. No, the boy. Don't you kill yourself. Blow this up. Blow. Blow this. This. Yeah. Oh, Abel, a little buddy. Right, let's try and catch this guy. Never mind. <laughs> he died. Right, let's not waste that. Hmm. So I've heard some good things, like a great thing to catch are those, you know, those invincible enemies? The ones that bounce around, the little white heads. Apparently they're really good to catch. I don't know if that's ever been <gasps> patched out. Larry Jr. Can I catch a Larry Jr.? I doubt it. I also, I really, really do not like this room. Free Larry Juniors. That can free room anywhere because of the lack of rocks. Luckily, Abel is here helping me out. Yeah, friendly ball could be really good. We've lost our D4, but to be fair, we were never really going to use it anyway. Because we would lose our holy mantle. Come on, that's got to be nearly dead. You've got to be nearly dead. You've got to be. There we go. And you're done too. Scab, HP, and luck. You know what? Luck is better than nothing. Luck is better than nothing, which uh, a regular HP would have been. Let's try and catch some cool stuff. Preferably not these, because I'm assuming they will kill me. I, I think we need a power-up at this point. We're just not very strong. Just keep my eye out for those maggots making a beeline straight for me. Get rid of you. Come on. Yes. Ooh, got a rune. Rune is Ansus. I'll pop it. We know there's a secret room right next to us, so we'll definitely bust that open. Also allows us access to the whatever room is next. Oh, do we do it? That's fine. That's, uh, fine. That was fine. The fire is just fine. Whew, that was, that was scary. We know these uh, item rooms up here. Right, you don't break things. You're not the exploding buttholes that I'm used to seeing. Uh, I'm trying. I am trying. Having a... A bomb spare. I'm going to try to get the small rock. You son of a gun. Give me some keys, please. You son of a gun. I need keys. I need like three keys. Ah! Okay, there's a key. That's one key. Question is, do we go into the item room or do we open a chest? Item room, we're guaranteed to get something, but we might not take it. The... Uh, chest may have more keys in it. Which means that then I can open the other chests and whatnot. Okay, right, we've got some keys. I think we're going to do a chest attack. Go ahead is fantastic. And there's our keys. Okay, I feel great. I feel two shot. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. Every so often we fire out a tooth that does a lot more damage than our regular attacks. And should we do this? Screw it. Why not? Why not? Pin? Oh, because this is a boss variant room. Okay, boss trap room, I believe it's called. The only issue we have at the moment is the fact that we are weak. Two shot is nice in that it will increase our damage, but it's not a constant increase, is it? So two shot is one of those things that's affected by our luck, so getting the scab for luck up. And can we catch a gaggling? Oh, we got a gaggling! 
Sweet. Oh yeah, we can fly. I don't have to worry about the creep. <laughs> We've got a gaggling on our team. That's really cool. It's probably going to die like super, super quick. But the fact that we have it is uh, awesome. So, uh, enemies that you bring out through the friendly ball will die. And since gaglings are the end kind of enemies that like to attack <gasps> via melee... While they're hurting the enemy, they'll also be hurt. But hopefully, as bosses, they'll be able to take a lot more damage. Swallowed Penny is uh, going to do nothing for us. That room does nothing for us. We can also bring out the Gaggling. Uh, we'll go to the shop. We've got loads of money. And we've got Popular Duplex. Two diamonds. Nice. Right, we might come back for a Populi Duplex. We probably should come back for it. Again, I'm calling it a Populi Duplex. I don't think that's the name. Populi Duplex is the wide shot thing, isn't it? That's something else that sounds like Populi Duplex. Go! Gaggling. Nice. Oh, and the poop is going to be really good. Better than Swallowed Penny. Yes, yeah, Swallowed Penny... Literally does nothing for us. Right, let's go gaggling. Let's go fight Fistula. You should be really good at this. Oh, look, there's... Oh, it's dead. <laughs> okay, okay, that's fine. Right, we're going to try to do this the sensible way because we're not very strong. And we're also very likely to die. Oh, no. Remember when I said I was going to do this the sensible way? Somehow that has changed to just panic and shoot everything. Okay, we're kind of okay. There we go. Get rid of this. Right. We should, repeat, should be safe. And uh, the popular duplex item, that's not popular duplex. It's called something else. Uh, will, should, maybe, come in handy against the devil deal. Or whatever item we get here. Mum's pills. But in here, two guppies hairballs, two two guppy hairballs, or two and two um, headless babies. I don't think that's what we want to double. So we'll leave that. Mom's pills. I don't think that's really going to do much for us. Explosive diarrhea, pheromones, bad gas. Are you a wizard? Ew. So there's nothing left to do here, is there? We can't catch anything. So friendly ball, all this. I think we take this, right? Diplopia, that's the one, not Popular Duplex. I think we have to take Diplopia. It's too good not to, especially with guaranteed devil deals. Because we could double up, like... Two succubus or two incubus or just all sorts of stuff. That's going to be interesting. And by interesting, I mean it's certainly something I want to do. I just absolutely want to make sure I have enough uh, keys first. Alright, we can't see our health, but that doesn't matter since we have none. The pheromones pill is going to come in very handy in the item room, boss trap room, mob trap room, whatever it is. All right, there's our two keys. I'm going to risk this. Please don't kill me. Bob's brain, which will probably kill me. All right, Headless Baby can do a fair bit of work here. I'm not going to pick up Bob's brain. I'm sorry, but unless I get something to protect me from explosions, I will just kill myself. Oh, the knock around on these is scary. I'm saving the pheromones for whatever comes next. These guys, so they can fight each other as far as I'm concerned. There you go. Have a little have a little fight up there. When you're ready, you can come down here and stand on my creep. I'm still not used to calling it creep, by the way. There's a coin. So we'll try to come back with a pair for her. Or if we get like host hats or pyromaniac or something similar to that. You're going to erupt into something and become clay, which is fantastic. Right, we've been hit. 
We should be fine. By the way, I'm diplopiering Guppy's Fairball, or Hairball. It wouldn't have counted as two Guppy items for the transformation. It still would have only counted as one, even though we would have two of them. Uh, sadly, they don't count if they are the same one. What could be very good to Diplopia is uh, Guppy's body. Or the dead cat, whatever it's called. Because that gives us nine lives. Even though, again, it wouldn't count as two Guppy items, it would give us 18 lives. As a lost, I feel that's pretty important. We need to smash poops as well because we have uh, the petrified poop. We have so much money. I'm going to try to hide behind the fire and let them kill themselves. Which is lovely. Also, the creep helps. Thank you to Abel there for destroying the fires I was trying to keep. <laughs> right, trying to be careful. Trying to be very careful. I have a feeling the secret room's there, but I'm not going to risk it. What is with all these hearts? Seriously, now. Okay, we're fine. No keys. Still okay. Petrified poop has no effect on those. Uh, still no keys. And of the pheromones. <laughs> Uh, I could probably rush this room, but I was just being careful. Give me some keys. Keys, keys, keys. Bats. Not fighting those. There's the boss. I'd rather... N oh, I didn't see the bat. I did not see the bat charging at me then. I was so focused on the bombs. Those bomb flies. Which could and did open the secret secret room. Just black feather. I get stronger the more evil items I pick up. Since I am doing devil deals, it's probably uh, going to be good for me. I think our choice now is to find some keys. Keys are absolutely vital to us at the moment. And there's really nowhere else we can go to find them. So our last shot right here. Don't like this, but oh, they're not so very strong. They're not very strong. There's a key. Right, I think we go to the shop, don't we? The fact that we have so much money and the fact we could just buy keys, I think that leads us to believe we should go to the shop. Two keys. Do we do shop and chest? I think we do. I think that is the best bet for a shop and chest. Please don't just contain hearts. Please give me something of value. Loki's mask! Which I always call Loki's mask and it's not actually called Loki's mask. Also, there's no keys here which suck. It's like a bomb. Hierophant does nothing for me. I was hoping uh, it would have been like teleport stars card style. Hmm. The stain! Trap between two poops is good, because he'll probably kill himself. Just gotta focus so, so, so much on not dying to the stain. Don't know where he is. It concerns me. Hello? Stain? You're kind of scaring me right now. Hello? Oh, good god. Oh, you son of a gun. I've lost my holy mantle because he popped up on me. This isn't fair. This is the worst boss fight I've seen in a long time. Sticking to the outer edges. Hopefully he's not going to hit me. This sucks. That is just... That is the worst. 25 minutes. I don't want to have another go, but I'm going to. Because uh, screw that. Like I said, with the Lost, if I get hit, it's probably my own fault. That was not. You see how much bullcrap that was. That was just ridiculous. I've never really had a problem with Stain before. I mean, when you're shooting all of these crazy bullets at me, I was able to dodge them all. Not a problem. 
And then all of a sudden, oh, quad shot. Yeah, I'll take quad shot. Um, and then all of a sudden, he's like, you know what? I'm not going to come up and fight you. I'm just going to wait until you're sitting on my face. And then I'm going to stick my head right up your butthole and uh, kill you. And that's what he did. So quad shot is interesting. I like it because it makes you powerful. But it also lowers your shot speed drastically. We've also a fair set of knockback as well, which is seemingly nice. So sometimes I do turn down quad shot. If you said to me, would you rather have quad shot or double shot? I would go double shot every time. Double shot uh, is double shots, but it has no noticeable effect on your fire rate, which is great. Uh, losing goat head sucks. As the lost, we don't take red hat damage, so we should be guaranteed devil deals anyway. But, here's the but. Just because you meet the requirements doesn't mean they're going to give you a devil deal. So you could quite easily not get hit and still not get a devil deal. So having them guaranteed is great. Having the ability to leave and re-enter devil deal rooms is great. And then there's a Larry dead. Bombs, I'll take some bombs. Troll bomb, yeah, great. Just add to my luck of just fantasticness. Oh, man. I'm so annoyed. I'm very salty about that last run. Very salty. It's, it's the worst because it doesn't feel like it's my fault. <laughs> that feels like it was just the game being really mean to me. Right, I know there's a double bomb room there that I could have gone in, but I was kind of checking maybe there is a way to bomb in from the side via a secret room. And I was considering, yes, that is correct, but since seeing this room, no, it is absolutely not correct. There is no secret room in between those. We can tell due to the fact, nope, that there's a like a line of bricks along the side. Also, there's bricks there, which means, no, so we'll risk this. What could there be? There could be a dice room. There could be a library type situation. Ooh. Doesn't that mean you're guaranteed? No, it doesn't. It's a clean room. Clean room. I've wasted all of our bombs. Ah. Clean room means black market style thing. Dirty room means level skip. That's something I, I've learnt and I got confused. I got it all backwards. Hopefully the lack of bombs isn't going to screw me over. It won't make sure larger. Sucks to get, but there are worse things it could have been. I am looking for a bomb now since I've seen a tinted rock. That sucked. Coin and a key is interesting. Oh yeah, we have the um, item room to go in yet. I forgot about that. I'm glad I didn't just go to the boss and leave. Double shot. Double shot on top of quad shot. What even does this do? Eight shots? One, two, three, four... Is that six shots I'm firing out there? Sweet! Six shots at once. <laughs> this is <laughs> this is really good. Wow. What I need now is like a... Uh, piercing. Piercing will be top notch. And then, in fact, we don't even need, really need damage up, do we? We just need... Uh, what's it called? We just kind of need to get speed up. Speed, shot speed up. I'll fire it up. It will be top notch. We'll be doing great against... Oh, Fistula. And look at the knockback we've got because of all of them. Right, I'm going to fight above this hole here. That way if any um, of those die, they won't drop maggots. Because the maggots will be above the hole. Therefore, they just despawn. Like this. Saves me fighting stuff. That I don't have to fight. Done. We get a syringe. Shot speed up is what we wanted. It's great. Nice. Guppy's tail is really good. Uh, is that Book of Sin? Book of Sin is nice. We won't take this guy. Remember what he does. He takes red hearts and gives you blue hearts. We can't take blue hearts. He could also give you enemy spiders, which would kill us. So we're not taking him. We've got a penny. Sweet. Moving down to the next slot. This, this is a fun run. This is definitely a fun run we've got going on here. This will more than likely be the one I put in the seed. I'm not going to add that amazing run that I lost thanks to just ultimate bullcrap of the stain because I just want to forget that ever happened. 
Leech, again, is a very nice item to have. Case of the Maze is sending us all over the shop. We don't know what this pill does. We'll use it later. Ooh. Oh. We can't get hit in here, by the way. Otherwise, we can never leave. We'll die. Pandora's box is very nice. We'll take that and save it. What the? No, oh, we're in the item room. I'm, I confused myself greatly there. Don't like this room. Alright, we've been hit. I'm scared about the champion ones because I don't know what kind of angles they'll shoot on. This one should detonate. Oh, it's Leech! Oh, careful, Leech. Please don't kill them while I'm hiding. Ah, yeah, 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 Leech. Are you going to shoot in all directions? I don't know. We'll open that. It's a bunch of stuff. Really good. Uh, Pandora's box, by the way, in case you don't know. What it does is different depending on which floor you are on. General consensus is saving it for as long as possible. But I always get it confused. Oh my goodness. I always think I should use it on a floor that I shouldn't and end up getting something that doesn't really benefit me. For example, later floors on, you can guarantee yourself angel items or like an uh, a devil deal item or a boss. Oh, that was good. Uh, no point wasting a bomb here, right? No, didn't think so, but I did it anyway. <laughs> what happened there, by the way? The case of the maze teleported is into the room that we would have had to uh, basically bomb into. Car battery is really good. Does car battery actually help Pandora's box? That's interesting to know. So if we use it on a floor that gets us two boss room items, would we then get four boss room items? More than likely, I'm going to use it on the floor that gives me um, some soul hearts. And then I'll curse myself forever because I've ruined it. I think I think the best time to use it is on the... F Necropolis, maybe? Maybe I should look this up. Maybe I should look it up indeed. Never use it on the chest as well. The chest is not going to be good. Where am I going? Giant room. I'm not doing that room because I don't want to risk my life for two regular chests. I'm going to hide here. Fire energy. Does nothing for me. I hid in case it was paralysis. If it had been pheromones, we would have been in business. If it had been... Explosive diarrhea, we could have run. If it had been any negative effects, we would have been okay in the situation we're in, just cursing the use of the pill. And if it had been positive, we would have been happy. Great. Paralysis. Ah, there we go. Right, so we know we've got a paralysis pill in play. And we know we'd have to worry about it. The boss is Peep. I don't like Peep, but it's okay. We're just going to push him as far away as we can. We do have uh, spectral tears so we can shoot through mushrooms and stuff. Piercing will be good because his eyes like to block shots. Leech is doing a good job over there. We just need to land our shots. The fact that he's jumping so much sucks. I would very much like him to sit still. Oh, again. Oh, I've been hit. Don't kill me. We did it. We did it. No devil deal? No devil deal. That's why go ahead is good. HP up. No. Does nothing for me. I'm just going to refuse to take it, in fact. Flooded Caves 2. Nope. I'm really excited to use Pandora's box with car battery. And experience the tremendous sadness of when I screw it up and use it on the incorrect floor and just get crap items. Like a bunch of coins or something. But I'll hold on to it for as long as uh, I feel comfortable for. If we find a really good active item that we want to replace Pandora's box with, we'll just pop Pandora's box straight away. Hmm. I'm thinking Pisces would be an interesting item to have. Oh, no, I've lost my shield. Because just imagine the knockback of six shots. Six Pisces shots. 
<laughs> okay, fine. I was worried. Bombs here? No. Why would I even think that? I have no idea. I'm scared by so many things in this. Are you a clear one that shoots into different angles? No, you're just a one that shoots into different angles. Did that mushroom contain a maggot? I have seven bombs. I'm kind of tempted to hold on to them just in case. We are doing pretty nicely on this run. I'm happy with it. Am I going to bomb this? Yeah, I am. The noose! Interesting! It's an item I really don't see that much. It, uh, it allows us to fly. <laughs> there we go. How interesting is that? We finally get a flying item. And we can already fly. So yeah, here's what I want. Give me a character that just has basic stats like Isaac. But starts with the noose. That is their starting item. That is a character I would love to see. I don't even think they need anything special about them. Maybe even, like, give them... Oh, go ahead. Legend. Maybe even give them, like, one red hat and two black hats or something along those lines. Just to make it a bit harder since you can fly. Maybe even no red hats. Just give me the character of the noose as a starting item. Oh, come on. All right, completely safe here. Nothing they can do to us. We still haven't found the item room. We still haven't found the item room. <laughs> we'll keep looking. Something that's going to change our tier effects would be really good. Fruitcake is a scary item. Oh, no. Because we'll be shooting out several six tiers, each of which can do something. Damn it. Each of which can do something different. Shoot. Shoot. I use my key on the chest. My goal... Oh, my goal. My motto is... It's probably better to open the chests. Because the chests could have more keys in them. Amongst other things. If we do not get a key now, I'm going to be very sad. Very, very sad. I think I'll put a bomb there. Yeah. Oh, come on. Oh, come on now. Ah, what do I, what do I do? We need to back up, we need to find a key. Again, but do we use it for the shop? Do we use it for the chest? Do we use it for the item room? I need a key, please. Would you care to give me a key? Any of you legendary, amazing enemies? Just drop me a key. Drop me a pair of keys. Drop me a set of keys. You buttholes. Right, so I'm missing out on the item room unless the boss is lucky enough to give us a latch key, which it could happen, it's just not very likely. Uh, well, uh, it annoys me having to leave these, but there's not much I can do. Oh, be good to me. Geddy, interesting. Go on, Leech. Leech, do you want to do a job for me, buddy? Do you want to get in there and fight? Leech. Leech, please. Is this a champion Geddy that doesn't shoot? Oh, Leech is doing his job. Marvellously. I think we're fighting a champion Geddy that doesn't fight back. So this just makes our job much easier. Get rid of that thing. Done. Magic Mush, HP and all stats up. Fantastic. Devil Deal. Judas' Shadow. Come back to life as Judas. Uh, no, we will not do that. We'll take... Headless baby. Why are we not taking that? Because we want to do it as a lost. That's why. Pex. Uh, we now leave. Very, very unfortunately, we have to leave. I'll forever wonder what was in that item room. If you play this seed... Ah, which I will show you in a second. NHT0TC9K. If you play the seed, let me know what's in that item room. Did I really just miss that item? Oh, come on now. Oh, come on now. 
Come on. You're having a laugh. Having a laugh. That's nice. I like this. Okay, we'll do it. Pills. Hats. Keys and stuff. Keys and stuff. Alright, this is going to be awkward because of our shot speed. We should one-shot them. Also, we have uh, whatever it's called. Headless baby leaving creep on the ground. We done? The pill is one makes you larger, which we don't want. We're already a giant floating head. Right, give me that bomb. There we go. We'll go this way. There's our item room, which we can access and we will access before any chests appear and we waste our keys. There we go. Oh, you... Cut your chip. Kidding me. Look up! No! No! Send me back! Got loads of money again, so a shop could be very useful. What floor are we on? Depth 1. Freeze effect. Okay. Wow, look at the varying degree of effects we get when we shoot these out. We're pretty much guaranteed a freeze effect. Just based on the odds. So if they survive, they're going to get frozen. Like that. So we can pretty much paralyze the enemies consistently. I have no keys. Alright, friendly ball on one of those white heads would be great. That's what I was going to try and catch. Because they're immortal, they cannot die. If the game allows you to do that. That invisible guy down there annoyed me. Let's get rid of him. ASAP. You're a champion. Yeah, there he goes with all this shooting stuff. Where'd that spider come from? Oh, there's a guy up there. Didn't even spy him. I thought he died. I thought I'd killed him long ago. Alright, we'll avoid all these fires. There's the boss. Nearly got hit. The brains are no longer as big of a concern to me as usual because I can fly. So the creep doesn't bother me. Take this. We'll take this. We... We'll not bomb either of those. Where is the secret room? That's very interesting. I have no idea where it is. I don't like this room. I'm going to keep moving for that. There we go. I hit the wrong one. Stop protecting each other. And they fly. Okay, well, good. There's a key. So we can go back to that golden chest if we need to. If we want to. If we really want to. Or we could save the key for the item room on the next floor. Do you see his quick heel turn then? Like he knew I was coming at him. He knew. A uh, key and a bomb is good. Also, I think the secret room is here. No. And it must be here, right? Makes sense. Oh! Burkano. What was that one? Pex. Pex is nothing for us. Pex halves the damage we take, since we can't take any. It does literally nothing. Ooh. Golden hat that does literally nothing. I was almost excited. In fact, I would dare say I was excited for a second. We will go to the shop. We'll take this. We'll take a key. And you know what? Let's put some coins back in here. Let's be kind to our machine that has paid out so much recently as the keeper. There we go. That feels good to donate back. So I think the secret room is going to be uh, just above us. These will shoot me to make me drop coins. I don't have any, so I could end up uh, quids in, actually, depending on how it works. Right, I'm going to do it the awkward way. Right, that's not the secret room. I have no idea where the secret room is, guys. Not a clue. Right, we are a little bit slow for boss rush. Luckily, we're not aiming for boss rush. But uh, getting to hush should be fine. We'll use our key on this chest. It paid out. Just about. 
But it's fine. We have Bacano. We'll pop that before we go into the boss fight. So we've got some spider stuff on our team. As well as Leech. Cage should be easy. Because we can hide from the cage. As soon as you see it start rolling out like a transformer. Also we can freeze it. Which is great. Oh, you brought a friend. This is a champion one that doesn't roll. The cage's only difficult feature is the fact that it can roll. Right, Devil Deal. Money! Fantastic. That's great for me, of course, because it's not like I need it anymore. Pit is good for flight and uh, speed up. Oh, hello. Didn't even notice you guys. And we'll take Sack Dagger because Sack Dagger is always amazing. We'll go down to the next floor. Are we going to use Pandora's box here? Uh, I don't know. We might save it for the womb. Ooh. Let's do this. And not kill ourselves. Ooh. Oh. Black market. Come on, you know you want to. Oh, damn it. Case die. Wow. No. If I get a pair for a room, we're coming back to reroll that. But... My goodness, absolutely not in your life am I picking up Kestai. I'm not even sure how it would work with this many shots we can fire. Yeah, I'll pay you some money. Be good to me. Give me something really amazing. Top-notch quality items. Two of clubs. Sure, I was just about to pop a bomb, so that was good timing. Kind of a, a Pex, is that over there? Or is that a... No, it's not a can of a can of a rune. No! Pex, sweet. You know what, let's use it right now. Half all damage. Oh, the card is strength. I guess it could come in handy. Two of hearts will not come in handy. We'll use it, get rid of it. Wow, can't believe that guy didn't uh, give us anything. Will the four more coins persuade you, sir? Just the two? Okay, cool. I'll take the map. We can now see exactly where we're going. We don't have the compass, we don't know what these rooms contain, but we do know for a fact that this room contains only death, and I regret ever coming in here. Why would I do this? Why? Would I even consider this a good thing to do? Okay, that was, that was great. That was great. We got all our money back that we spent on that one little donation guy. Well, I think we're given, we're given 19. Oh, we're still fine. Chest. Bombs and stuff is good. We've got enough bombs that a bomb synergy item wouldn't make me cry. I'd like it. Hot bombs. Sad bombs would be insanely good. Sad bombs fire your tears on all sorts of directions. Since our tears are six tears, it would shoot basically a million tears everywhere. Cartridge gives us the chance to become invincible. So I'll take it. I'm not sure what proxy invincibility aspect of it. I just know it can. Necronomicon. Mass room damage. Also, something I learned recently is that picking up a book increases the odds of finding a... a library on the next floor. So that's interesting. That's something I... Didn't know until recently. Get rid of this. And they, oh, they got frozen as soon as they came out. They didn't have a clue what was going on. Ay, ay, ay. Alright, into the shop. It's a library. Cool. Anarchist cookbook. There's really nothing for us. Book of Belial is decent. The Bible will kill the final boss for us. Book of Revelations doesn't do anything. So we'll take this. Haha, -ha, screw that room. No, we've lost our HP. Our, the only thing that protects us. Okay, we're safe. Whew. Ooh, that was bad. Oh, no, that was in, just idiotic. Alright. We're fine. Honestly, uh, getting freeze effect was so good because of our a myriad of shots that we have. What I would really love is some kind of look-ups now. Right. Okay. I'm feeling safer. Feeling safer. 
Feeling much safer than I was a minute ago. Guppy's paw! Is that our second guppy item or our first? Uh, 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 uh. That's our second guppy item. One more to become guppy. Halo is an all stats up. Rosary is a faith up, and I think it gives us some. Um, oh yeah, what's it called? Soul hats as well. The Seraphim transformation is not the one I was thinking of. We only have one eye. Seraphim, I believe, allows us to fly. So I don't think that helps us. The. Ooh, no. Oh, that's lovely. We're going here for the shop, which has greed. And he did amazing. Round of applause for Greed, ladies and gentlemen. Round of applause. What makes you small is good because of all the big ones we had. Oh. Uh, we're done. Got to go fight the boss, I guess. We'll pop strength. Uh, we'll save Pandora's box. It's not a champion version, but it is going to die. Oh, my goodness. I forgot freeze effect could work on the foot. Oh, we did. We did it. We won. I'm going to take this. I'm going here. Krampus. Sucks. We did it. Lump of coal. Excellent. Excellent item to get. See me getting super risky using <laughs> Sack Dagger there. Yeah, that was scary for me too. So do I use Pandora's box here? What comes after the after this? It's Hush. Then after that, it is the Cathedral. So let's use it here. We've got two items. Shot speed up, which is good. And Ton Futter for a little friend. Ton Futter? What am I about? Little Steven for a friend. Gaglings. What are our stats right now? Our damage isn't too bad for um, what little we've picked up. It's all stat upgrades, isn't it? Why did I come in here? I know I want to get out of here ASAP. Right, where would the boss be? I don't think it's going to be up there. Oh, it could be. Let's go up here. So we've got to fight two bosses here, and remember there are no item rooms. We could potentially find a beggar. I hate these rooms. We could potentially find a beggar to give our money to, but it's unlikely if we're not exploring. A couple of bombermen's. Bomberman's. Bomber people. I'm not going to assume their gender. Let's just keep firing these out. And we're done. Mr. Boom. You know what? Better than nothing, and we didn't go the correct way, so we're going to try to get out of here. ASAP. I'll do this first, though. Okay, it was worth it. Worth it to know for sure. Right, it's got to be all the way down there, then, hasn't it? It's got to be, and I really don't want to do that. Ugh, great. I'm just trying to check, trying to take the shortest possible route down to the boss because uh, you know what enemies in here deal double damage but it doesn't matter because uh, we can't get hit anyway this is a dead end why did I come in here oh pin feel bad for you son feel very bad for you there's got to be a secret room there right nope there's got to be a secret room here right nope okay then okay then why would I go the incorrect way oh no no! I hate these rooms. Rooms with the eyeballs are the worst. You can end your run just before you even know it. So I'm going back up because I think there's a secret room there. Cool. If that's an Emperor card, I will... Oh, the stars. The stars card is interesting. Pretty fly is really nice. We'll hold on to the stars card. It could come in handy. We've got three minutes to get to the boss. Okay. To get to to, uh, get to and defeat two bosses. Okay, there's the boss. Right, we found it. We did go the correct way this time. What haven't we done? What haven't we done? Right. So this is to get to Hush. Triaknid. Okay. Okay. We did it. Mum's coin pass. Fine. We'll, um... We don't want that. That's alright, that's fine. There's nothing for us. They buffs. They literally did nothing for us. It lives. Ugh. Ugh. 
Have we been hit? I can't tell. I think we have. Okay, let's use that. We did it. We did it. Just don't get hit. Run, baby's great. Oh, we've got the conjoined. We're going to shoot so much now. We shoot six down and one on either side. <laughs> that was scary. Do we have any keys? Oh, I hope we have keys. We have two. Do we get items or do we do shop? I think we shop. There's no keys in the shop. <laughs> we take a damage up. Sure. We'll take a damage up. And uh, no, I think we'll go in here. 99 bombs. Why not? Why not 99 bombs? What do our bombs do at this point? Nothing? Just regular bombs? Great. What if we use a stars card? Yes! Excellent! Right. Explosiva. Okay, now I'm feeling good. Now I'm feeling good. I'm glad I saved that stars card. So this is the Lost versus Hush. If I lose here, it's over. I'm not going to do another run. And we're at 56 minutes. It's really long. Uh, NHT0, TC9K. Let's go. Let's fight Hush. Just look how many Explosiva shots we're landing. It's just a shame our damage is abysmal. Although I guess that works in our favour because it means Hush is not going to scale up very well. Oh, we can freeze him as well, which is great. I'm not going to risk using the knife. Sack dagger. Although it could do a lot of damage, I'm not going to risk using it. Because uh, his hitbox is a bit wonky, isn't it? Also, freezing him allows the explosiva shots to go off. Normally, I don't think they would detonate in time before he sinks underneath the ground like that. So what I'd really love is um, a game kid to go off. Having game kid go off allows me to get in really close to sack dagger. So my commentary may suffer here because I'm focusing so crazy hard. So crazy, crazy hard right now. I dropped a bomb on my spot and then didn't move from said spot. Oh, I, I evaded it. I don't know how. The worst thing for me right now is going to be Continuum Tears. Because I... It's like pure luck whether or not you're going to get hit to begin with. Alright, I don't think we've been hit yet, right? Okay, okay, we're landing, landing lots of shots. Lots of shots. The worst is yet to come, though. The worst is yet to come by far. Come on, Game Kid, please. There's Continuum Shots. We're going to stand still. I hope we don't get ki killed. We seem okay so far. We seem okay so far. Oh, goodness gracious me. This is scary. This is super scary. There's Continuum Shots done. Holy moly. Oh, no more Continuum Shots. We've frozen him. We're dealing damage. My heart is going a mile a minute. I dare not even move because of the Continuum Shots. I'm waiting for those tornadoes to come and just kill me. I'm absolutely waiting for it. Right, ladies and gentlemen, that is the easiest hush fight we have ever done. And we did it with the Lost. We didn't even get hit. Holy Mantle. Who needs Holy Mantle? We didn't get touched with the Lost against Hush. That is, that is crazy to me. I wish I had more keys, though. Got four chests there we could uh, go and get. I also took a thing to make the game harder. Cool. Uh, we've, we just need to fight Mega Satan now, and that is not happening. Because uh, it's impossible for us to do that. The boss is going to be down. So right now, regardless of whether we die or not, we've won. We did what we set out to do, and that was defeat Hush. In fact, we could very much lose in this room. Uh, no keys. Full health. Yay. Great. Great. 
I can't believe though the whole quad shot and on top of double shot on top of Seraphim, eh, not Seraphim, conjoined. So we're shooting 10 shots at once now. So exp Explosivo and Freeze effects are items that don't really work that often. It's like a luck based thing. But the fact, even if our luck is low, we fire so many shots off, we're guaranteed. We're guaranteed to have something happen. Crow's foot. Nah, I'd rather have Game Kid. Didn't see that. Did not see that uh, little fly there at the end. Uh, I could go and look for the secret room. I. Uh, I'm not going. Uh, you know what? I might as well. If I die now, though, I'm going to be really annoyed. I think it's just in here. I think it's there, right? Oh, God, no! I lost my, whatever it's called, instantly there. I lost my holy mantle instantly because four bosses dropped on my head. You know, I am going to look for the secret room a little bit. It could be here. I think it probably is here. Oh, great. The secret secret room. Uh, oh, look up is really good. The secret secret room could be in many, many places. I'm not going to bother searching for it because I've already looked in a couple. We have 90 bombs. What's the worst going to happen? But, you know what, Isaac. If we can do this to him, it would be great. I can hide in this corner. Come on, being able to just paralyze him with these. Oh, we did it! <laughs> that was over quicker than I expected. To the chest, the best thing that could happen now, which won't happen, we have no keys. I was hoping we could get a um, dad's key. If dad's key popped out one of these chests, then that would mean we could fight Mega Certain. I don't like all this extra other crap. Yeah, great. Amazing shot. Shoot a spider directly on top of me. I would like some keys. Any keys? You want to give me some keys? Chests? Yeah, good. But I want keys because I can't open them without. Give me a pill. Give me bombs equal keys. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh. Oh, well. NHT0TC9K. We just defeated the Hush with the Lost in easily the most simple fight we've ever had. The most heart racing fight we've ever had, but the simplest. Thank you for watching. Leave a comment down below. Which character would you like to see me play tomorrow? Uh, Isaac, Maggie, Kane, Judas, the Poop, the Baby, question marks, Eve, Samson, Azazel, Lazarus, Eden, the Lost, Lilith, or the Keeper. I never thought I'd see the day I do the, the the hush with Lost. I honestly didn't. That is one of the hardest things out of the way with in my mind. Sure, we lost in the end, but we did what we needed to do. Whew, thank you for watching. For now, though, goodbye.